I'm going to make a, a pakori, wedge pakori. I don't know if you have heard of this. This is like kind of like, because his last few days was raining and this is like rainy weather snacks. So we're going to have this for dinner actually, because we're not so hungry. So we think, oh, let's have a pakori. So we say in India, chai and pakori time. So I'm going to make a pakori, it's wedge pakori. So what we need for this? We need uh, Hindi, we call besan. And so I'm using one cup of uh, chickpea flour. You know, chickpea flour, you can make your own or you can buy chickpea flour any store. It's very common to find. And one cup of water. And I'm using a little bit of cauliflower, like a one cup of cauliflower and half cup of onion. So I'm gonna make, these are like two different, like you can make, you can mix all together. Or you can do, you know, you can use a potato. You can like cut potato like a chip style small and make a potato one and you can use uh, uh, like uh, broccoli you can use spinach so you know it's like uh, you can use anything so it's pretty healthy you know like it's uh, called veg pakori so we need just and we, we just need uh, one uh, I'm gonna add one tablespoon of so this is like half teaspoon of uh, salt and I'm gonna use uh, twice so means one teaspoon and a little bit chili powder, like uh, one teaspoon of chili powder, just for some flavor. And and I'm gonna add all this uh, vegetable here. You know, you can mix all together. And, this, and onion also. You know, lots of I just like lots of onion and uh, you know vegetable. And and today my son is here. He's gonna help me with this. So. So it's gonna mix all this. Okay, mix it. So I'm gonna add water. water. Just start with a little half cup of water first and mix this well. So my son is here to his is like here to help me. Okay. Uh, after we mix all this, see uh, after I mix and I forgot to add some uh, baking powder. I'm gonna use half teaspoon of baking powder. You know, if sometimes if you don't have baking powder, don't worry about it. You don't have to put. If you have, it's fine. So, you know, our easy way to mix this, you can mix for the first uh, chickpea flour, you know, with water, and then you add vegetable and then mix a little bit more, you know. So I mixed it well. So see how it looks. So, and I started heating this oil here. So this is olive oil. I use half cup of olive oil. So, you know, so, not so much. So I don't have to like deep fry this. Um, so here, uh, oil is hot. So start with the, you know, high, and then you can just do low heat when it's when oil is hot so just see this pretty hot and then i just low this so and I start with this and i'm gonna start there we go for a few minutes and i'm just checking how this pakori is in the back see then look like a little bit golden brown so you can just flip this all the spaghetti you can use a fork it's easier also and you can use some other anything is easier for you you know whatever is easy it's not like you know hard and fast any rule like you no know, whatever's easy for you so i'll just uh, flip this all spaghetti and then i'm gonna cook them for a few more minutes you know yeah. you know if you want to like see like how the you know salt and if any more like chili powder if you need to add it, you know, this is the, I make this better, so you can just, you know, take a little bit in spoon or like in your finger, you can just uh, taste it because it's a chickpea flour, it's not going to harm you, you know, just taste, if you need more salt, you can add more, like, you know, anything, you just, you can just add it. You know? So this is like very simple and basic way I'm just teaching how to make this pakori and this tastes pretty good. Sometimes you find a recipe has so many stuff to use, but you don't have to use all the stuff, you know. See now we'll just check after a few minutes. I'm gonna check how this this looks pretty good. See it's getting golden brown. It's almost ready. So I'm gonna flip this again a little bit, like maybe just one more minute. And you know, and because this uh, you know the flour soaks the oil also so much. So but that's why I don't start. I don't uh, deep fry this. You know, I just start with small oil. Then I don't have to deep fry so much. Then we don't have to you know add uh, so much you know oil so if i need like more i can just add a little bit more you know later so simple like our pakori almost done so i just uh, you know i'm gonna 
put my cocoa in there, you know, the paper towel, then paper towel will soak some oil and cover this up. It's good to eat like hot cocoa, you know. So I'm gonna like, you know, see uh, here and eat with ketchup. Pretty good, you know. You see like, you know, you can even taste first, you know, see like similar pokori you need to cook more. It's look like if you taste like a little raw, you can put, put it back also, you know, and try to like, you know, just uh, cook more. So this is our pokori already. Let me taste, you know, and see. 